this time. You guys wanted violence? You got it. These are my top five most violent VR games. Stay tuned. Discover the true meaning of fear and alien isolation. I know why you're working in the A survival horror set in an atmosphere of constant dread and mortal danger. You're still looking. 15 years after the events of Alien, Alan Ripley's daughter Amanda enters a desperate battle for survival on a mission to unravel the truth behind her mother's disappearance. Underpowered and underprepared, you must scavenge resources, improvise solutions, and use your wits not just to succeed in your mission, but to simply stay alive. Overcome an ever-present deadly threat. Experience persistent fear as a truly dynamic and reactive alien uses its senses to hunt you down and respond to your every move. You must improvise to survive, hack systems, scavenge for vital resources, and craft items to deal with each situation. Will you evade your enemy, distract them, or face them head on? Alien's Isolation is $10.99 and is for the Oculus, HTC Vive, PSVR, and Windows Mixed Reality. High alert, all tower troops. Receiving reports of a large stockpile of supplies from... This can't be right. A, a, a large stockpile of supplies Desperate from factions and lone survivors who could be your friend or foe. Wired the blow. We'll smoke her out. You're lazy. Whether you choose to help or take what you want by force, every choice you make has consequences. Scavenge for anything that you can. Weapons, food, tools, or clues. But be weary of living dead. Spatial audio will draw your attention to any loud noise, bullets, or otherwise. Shelter in the school to avoid our wrath. Oh, suckling pigs. Craft makeshift gear out of scrap metal, guns, medicine, and more. This time, lock it down before the tourist gets there. Saints and Sinners Aftershock is scheduled to release on the Oculus Quest May 20th. The era of weightless VR wiggle sword combat is over. Blades and Sorcery is a medieval fantasy sandbox like no other, focusing on melee, range, and magic combat that fully utilizes a unique and realistic physics-driven interaction and combat system. Built exclusively for VR, dictated by fine hitboxes, objects have weight and follow the laws of physics. Creatures have full body physics and presence, and blades can be used to penetrate through soft material or deflect magic. In Blades of Sorcery, the combat is limited only by your creativity. Choose your weapon, choose your sword stance, choose your fighting style, be the most powerful warrior, ranger, or sorcerer you always dreamed of becoming. 
Blades and Sorcery is $22.79 and is for the Valve Index, HTC Vive, Oculus, Windows Mixed Reality, and the PSVR. Gorn is a ludicrously violent VR gladiator simulator made by Free Lives, the developers of Brute Force and Genital Jousting, featuring a unique fully physics-driven combat engine. Gorn combatants will be able to creatively execute their most violent gladiator fantasies in virtual reality. Savagely strike down an infinite supply of poorly animated opponents with all manners of weapons. From swords, maces, and bows to nunchucks, throwing knives, massive two-handed warhammers, or even your blood-soaked bare hands. The only limits to your carnage are your imagination and decency in the most brutal and savage face-smashing VR game ever produced by man. Gorn costs $21.99 and is for the Valve Index, HTC Vive, Oculus, Windows Mixed Reality, and the PSVR. Did you guys think that Gorn was number one? Come on. I got one more for you. This is the most violent game that I have personally played, and I have a feeling it's going to be yours too. <laughs> All right, so before we get into that game, make sure you guys hit the like button, subscribe if you guys want to become a part of the VR Asylum, and leave a comment down below and let us know what the most violent game you have played is. All right, on to number one. Experience what has been called the most realistic gore system ever in Raid Sandbox and Arcade Mode. Take on the role of a heartless killer for hire and see why Blood Trail has come to be known as the most violent VR game ever. You are Wendigo, a hard-hearted contract killer motivated only by a paycheck. With a trusted arsenal at the ready, you are tasked with annihilating a fanatical cult. Built from the ground up for VR using proprietary character physics and gore systems. Blood Trail offers an unprecedented shooting experience not for the faint of heart. With realistic gun mechanics, damage effects, you will have no margin for error. As you use your pistol, shotgun, rifle and fist to become the last man standing in this nightmarish and brutal scenario. Blood Trail is for the HTC Vive and the Oculus.